Um, I'd like to ask you why is it so important to improve the European Citizens Initiative? But simply because the ECI uh, didn't work. There was an enormous effort and enormous enthusiasm in people who signed, who, who created, uh, uh, invented initiatives, but uh, only three uh, initiatives were successful. And we are creating distance and people in Europe, rightly I think, uh, Mm, f uh, feel very often that the in European institutions are distant and sometimes arrogant. And I think we should, uh, we should uh, break this uh, wall. And what will the Parliament do to really make the, to pressure the Commission to change the regulation on, on the ECI? Now that we have to receive the response from the Commission. So we are asking the Commission to start this revision to change um, a good number of, of things. Now first of all, I have brought in amendments for a change of regulation because that was not clear. We were talking about for a long time about improvements, but not clear, uh, didn't uh, call clearly for change of the regulation. That's in the text now. So this is a helpful addition, uh, these 76,000 signatures. So I think the Commission is ready to move. It's just a question occasionally of helping them to move in the right direction, which I hope will be ready next year sometime. Well, the Parliament has today uh, made an important step towards the demands of the citizens, but unfortunately some of the further reaching reforms were not adopted. Anyway, the struggle for a true participatory European democracy is something we cannot win in one or two days. It will be a long-run struggle with the NGOs and uh, we have to succeed to make Europe closer to the citizens. Democracia directa in Europa. Más democracia para Europa. Ich bin für mehr Demokratie in Europa. Mis democracia para Europa. Mehr Demokratie, auch in Europa. Mehr Demokratie, auch in Europa. Auch.